Dr Pam Benito and I'm a aesthetic medicine specialist based in central London. Um, I have been in the field of aesthetics for 12 years and I'm here today with the lovely Georgia. She's one of my regular patients and we're going to be talking about lip filler treatment. So Georgia, tell us about what your expectations were when you came in. Yes, yeah, so um, first of all, I'd like to say that having lip fillers, I didn't take it very lightly. I did loads of research before coming to see Dr Pam. Um, two years worth of actually before I decided to have them because obviously you've probably seen loads of box jobs out there I wanted to make sure I was in expert hands. I knew she was a doctor, I looked into all her qualifications, her experience, um, all of her previous clients and her before and after shots and everything so I knew I was going to be in safe hands and I really wanted a natural look. I didn't want to have big like puffy lips, um, I wanted to just have a really subtle enhancement and looking at her previous work I could see that she was a right woman to go to. Um, so yeah, my expectations were good. I was a little bit nervous, but yeah, that's what I wanted to achieve. So how was your experience on the day? Yeah, it was great. As soon as I arrived at Dr Pam's practice, all those nerves went away. The place is beautiful and so zen. Um, there's beautiful lighting and you have beautiful calming music. She puts candles on, so you feel really at ease. And she talks you through the whole procedure before she goes ahead and does anything making sure she knows exactly what the look you're looking for is. Then she tailors what she's going to do and the product she's going to use and tells you all about it. So you're all like handheld through the whole process, which is really lovely. And even before she starts, she puts numbing cream on your, on your lips. So you don't feel the procedure at all. It's like this insane numbing cream that I just, and these lovely thin needles that she uses. So I didn't feel it at all. And I was really happy at the end of it. So you spoke to me through all the aftercare and everything. So I went away feeling very happy. Good. I'm very glad to hear. And uh, how was the recovery uh, after the procedure? Yes. Yeah, so as I said, Dr. Pam does talk you through in great detail about how to look after lips after you leave. So, you know, don't put some product on it at first. Make sure you get some arnica oil to stop the bruising and ice the lips so that you reduce bruising and swelling as much as possible. However, obviously you can only go so far, like your lips have had those injections in them, so they will bruise and swell up a little bit. Um, but this goes away within like seven days and then your lips are looking lovely and beautiful and you'll be really happy with the results. Well, thank you so much for coming in today, Georgia. No it's been a pleasure, really happy with your lips and uh, hopefully we'll see you again soon. And for any of you who would like to come in, uh, find out a bit more about lip filler treatments or any other procedures, uh, please feel welcome to uh, drop me a line or send me an email and I look forward to seeing you soon. Mm -hmm.